So recently I've had quite a few raids where I haven't quite panned out. They haven't been the raid I was expecting. And don't mean this in like I've had some deep profound moment. I mean literally I was planning to go on that raid and then that didn't happen. So I ended up going on that raid at a different time or later that day or with someone else or with no one else. More often than not, no one else. And that I know some of us will relate to is family life. And that's just life. So that kind of adapting to that kind of family writing situation where you've got kids, things never turn out as they planned, but just to roll with that because that's where the fun and adventure lies. And a great example of that, supposed to be going with writing some buddies, I ended up going writing with my wee boy instead. He's only free in a bit, so get him in the seat, get in the single speed, get up the hill. Much more powerful and potent ride than if I was out there on the Spitfire doing the normal thing. Just being there with my boy on the hill. Magic. That's where memories are made and that is probably the best rides of this year have been like that. Whether they've been up Loch Neck or just up local hills or just fire road bashing around the local kind of spots. Those are the, the rides that stick longest in the memory. So yeah, kind of a boring, but that's just, that's just the truth of it. You know, it's not that you don't still enjoy getting rowdy, it's not that you don't still look for progression, but sometimes you have a planned ride, you're gonna go meet with friends, you're gonna go to that race. Sometimes things just don't align and you end up having to go for a different ride. That's why I end up running so much by myself most of the time, because it's herding pigeons and coalescing stars in great conjunctures to get a bunch of dads with bikes together. And sometimes the easiest thing to do is just roll with it, try and take them with you. Sometimes it's easier said than done. If you have similar experiences, or you've got oh, any kind of hints and tips about trying to get more riding time with the family, or within family life. Let us know down in the comments, let us know your strategies and life hacks. And uh, thanks for watching.